What's up guys and welcome back to another ripping and sipping video. So back to wine today, uh, we have a Spanish Albariño from Rias Bayas, uh, 2019 vintage, very good. Same taste the difference, very good. But that's not what you're really here for, you're here for the packs. Uh, so let's look into them. Okay, so we have a wild mix. Uh, you saw a few of these in the GSI video the other week. Uh, Goodwin Champions, which is a random mix. Hoops, looking for Lonzo Ball there. Uh, some MLS soccer, which is my first time opening MLS product. Synergy Hockey, first time opening that hobby. And quite a few basketball. No football today, uh, but we have, sorry not basketball, baseball. Uh, we have quite a few. We have a uh, pack from Update. Chrome, we have a pack from 2020 Chrome Normal, we have Heritage Hobby, we have a Baseball Series 121, and then we have two more Hobby from Elite, uh, sorry, Extra Edition, and we have Alan Ginter Tops Chrome to finish. So let's start with the soccer. Um, I do not know if there's any real huge hits in here in terms of uh, which rookies are coming out. I don't know if this is Western McKinney's year or if there's anyone really about here. Uh, but let's get into pack one, see what we can discover. I do believe there's autos in the box, so maybe we strike an auto. We shall see. We have uh, Joseph Claude Giao, uh, FC Cincinnati guy, which would technically be my MLS team. I don't really follow them. It seems like they've had a tough start to the year. It looks like there's some color in this. Nicholas Mesquida. Greg Garza, so we're picking all the Cincy guys. Uh, we have a blue, Christian Pavon uh, for the Galaxy. Number 299 on the blue. Uh, Pavon came in the 2019 transfer window. Dynamic winger. There we go, maybe that's a big card, probably not. A Reggie Cannon on the throwback there for Dallas. Christian Roldan, Atlanta team card. Into Miami team card. Wow, that looks incredibly photoshopped. Surely that's not a real. These heads look incredibly large. Uh, maybe they just have large heads. Who knows? Uh, moving on quickly, we'll go for the good bit champions. Uh, so random stuff you can get in here. You can get some booklets. Um, I don't believe this is thick enough to be a booklet. I've never really pulled anything great from here, to be honest. Um, so we'll see what we get this time. We have Joe Moravsky, who is an athlete. American Ninja Warrior, interesting choice. Casey Mize, that's a big baseball prospect for the Detroit Tigers. Big Boy, uh, whose son goes to Oregon. We do have a filler, damn it. I say we have a filler, yeah, it's just an interesting choice of filler. It has a different color card there, uh, but it is a filler. So nothing amazing here. We have Robin Bone, who's a pole vaulter, and Mark Henry, WWE wrestler slash strongman. Uh, let's move on to Synergy Hockey. So we're looking for all metal greats. Um, only three cards a pack. So it'll be interesting to see what we got. If you watched the last one, we actually were missing a card. Um, yet to be sorted by upper deck but they promised me they'll send me something this is a fun one to start it's got some sort of acetate uh, deal with it again some sort of strange uh, redemption code scratch um, which they don't really explain so <laughs> I do have to say if, you, if you're not a hockey fan they don't really explain what you're meant to do with these cards if you know uh, comment and let me know but that's a John Carlson uh, for the Washington Capitals what looks like a base synergy FX of John Tavares the Maple Leaves, and a constant threat, David Pastrnak for the uh, Boston Bruins. Again, just don't really understand hockey or how upper deck works, but there we go. Do understand what we're looking for here, and his name is Lonzo Ball, or Anthony Edwards to an extent, uh, but definitely Lonzo Ball. Hoops is normally very much a base end, kind of your opening day, big league of basketball compared to baseball uh, but some of these cards are crazy money at the minute Batiste Feibel, Kyle Lowry, Hassan Whiteside, Jonas Valencianas, Dwayne Bacon, 
We have a rookie, Cole Anthony. It's the magic. We got next. Isaiah Stewart and Jordan Nawara. Nawara. Nothing super amazing there. Never mind. Moving on to the main event, we have some baseball. So this is actually the first pack of 21 Series 1 I'll ever open. Um, so we'll see what we get in here. Anyone's interested in odds, I'm sure you've seen it, but there's some odds. Feel free to pause. Um, a lot of guys coming into this Series 1 set because of the delay uh, around last year and a, kind of the strangeness about last year. A lot of guys aren't on this. My only big issue with this is how hard it is to read this kind of small text here. Uh, I do like the base design, loving the 70 stamp, but that text surely should have been kind of flagged that it needed a bit more clarity. Never mind. Uh, Adam Fraser, Brandon Nemo, we had there. Charlie Morton, Matt Chapman, Joaquin Soria. We have a uh, Slam Diego card with a little Tatis there on the front. Trevor Williams. Hunter went Wenfro, a Renfro, and Griffin Canning. One of the old throwback cards of JD Martinez. Future stars Jose Okidi, Daniel Johnson for the Indians rookie, Dalton Varsho for the Diamondbacks, and for the Blue Jays, Santiago Espinal. Nothing super huge there. Maybe some short prints, but I have not checked the codes. Comment if you saw one. Moving on to Heritage. Um, we shall see what we get in here. We've got, this must be minor league, Volcanoes, Hunter Bishop, Matt Mannings for the Seawolves, uh, Gabriel Cancel, Naturals, for the Montgomery Biscuits, Vidal Burhan. Uh, we have a chance to play with the Iron Pigs. I believe we're probably too late for this one. Doesn't seem to say, but that was your chance to play with the Lehigh Valley Iron Pigs. Evan White. Ryan Rollison and Bobby Dahlbeck is probably our best card in there. Didn't look at the short numberings there. Um, I do like Heritage. I'm excited for next year's uh, that is coming out as we speak. Much more colourful design, which I do kind of prefer to the plain blacks. Uh, 2020 Chrome here, Carl Schwaber. Giracella, very nice. Second year, Tatis. Base, but a still a very nice card and sought after. We also have a Prism of Xander Bogarts. Very nice looking card indeed. Do you like the Prism? Own a Tatis Prism 10, which has gone fairly crazy recently. Uh, Chrome update, same design obviously, just some different photos. We've got some throwbacks for the All-Star game and Home Run Derby. So we've got Andrew McCutcheon, we've got Javi Baez, Alex Bregman, and a Rookie Cup, Pete Alonso. Nothing super amazing there. Finishing with some hobby. So Elite Extra Edition, probably going to get an auto in here, we'll see, maybe a patch. We have Carter Baumler, number 2999. Jared Jones on the Chrome, we do have an auto behind it, I believe. We do, we have, ooh, it looks like we have two back-to-back. -back. Uh, AJ Vukovic, 249 status there. Oh, look at that, that's amazing. Uh, we get Austin Hendrick, my guy, uh, Cincinnati guy, super happy with that one. Don't believe it's numbered, is not numbered, sticker auto, but that's an awesome, awesome pull. Super happy with that one, get a sleeve on that in a second. And Casey Martin, that one is on a chrome substate, this seems to be on paper, not numbered. Um, not a huge idea of where this guy is, uh, but Casey Martin. So two autos from one pack, certainly take that, very happy with that. And Jared Jones there. Last pack will be our Ginter uh, Chrome. This stuff is notoriously hard to pick autos. They run about one per case. I do have a Votto auto, which was lucky to pull. I do have a Mini in our pack, I believe we do. So we have Miguel Cabrera, Stanton. Our Mini is Victor Robles, not bad at all. And a um, Tom Glavain to finish. There's our Mini of Victor Robles. So not bad at all. I will very much take uh, two autos from one pack. We'll take the T second year Chrome. Uh, and Austin Hendrick on a Chrome is a very, very nice card. Um, so nice break, nice random pack opening, and some nice wine to go with it. So until the next one, see ya.